Would you say Tim G's Excel spreadsheets? Okay, so this is another time I like to trade. Uh, it's now 2 in the morning for me, or 2.30 in the afternoon. I saw this stock in, in my radar this morning from the chat room, plus it's a huge percent gainer. Why? It's up on, it's E-R-I-I, -R -E -R and it is up on uh, just this news about, I uh, scored this uh, Schlumberger deal, whatever it is. Uh, I didn't really read much into it. All I know that it's a uh, contract win, basically. You know, they will pay $75 million exclusively uh, in two parts, million, blah, blah, blah. This is actually just the headline article from Yahoo uh, Finance. So, I uh, basically has been watching this stock all day. It had a bear, very bearish pattern, head and shoulders pattern, we call this. You know, the two shoulders right here and their head. Oh, my go to meetings out. Sorry, Michael. Good. I'm doing this during his thing. Um, anyway, so we have here, we have one bottom here. We have another bottom here. And we have a third bottom here. I saw this bottom happening. I didn't want to, I almost wanted to dip by here, but it was still midday. You know, it was like 1250-ish. And that's usually not a good time to dip by. Sometimes it is, but, uh, you know, it, it bottomed here and it bottomed again. But when it bottomed again over here and it would hold it, I let it, I, I saw it, see if it would like crack it, but it wouldn't crack it and it was actually holding out. And if we look here in the long term chart here, somehow my internet has disconnected me. Come on internet, where, where did you go? Alright, well either way my internet, someone has disconnected me. Um, you know, if you look long term here, this is a three year chart. There is a support level here hitting at 618-ish. And what do you know? Somewhere here at 618. Today is the top of this. And it's also the bottom of here. Somewhere around here, right? So somewhere around the 615s there. Somewhere around there. So it bottomed out here. Bottomed here. And now you can see it's running up to the 670 uh, almost. You know, my goal was to dip by here at the 620s and sell it into the 650s you know that's that's pretty good risk reward and my risk was literally five cents a share downside and about uh 30 cents upside so you know that's like one to six and literally i sat there watching this level too and i was i had my what i usually do is i put my sell order uh at my risk just in case or just a, a few cents uh, one or two cents below my risk and i just hit the sell button and i sit there waiting for the Thing. And if it goes, hits that, and I, I'm, I'm literally out of the sale. And I usually never do it at a round number, just knowing from Tim. So I did that, but it never got close. And I would watch this bid stack up, and it would bounce back up. And so after that happened, I was like, okay, I'm, I'm good to go. Uh, I'm gonna keep watching this, and it, it, it kept, it kept pushing upwards. Um, it had a little trouble trying to break 630s ish. So I essentially just sold after that point. I just couldn't handle it. Just knowing that there's a lot of resistance here at this, these tops over here. So, you know, if it's 640, then, you know, whatever it was. I mean, I only had a tiny, tiny position. And I finally sold off when... And then, you know, I've, I saw some other people in the chat room as well. They also, this this other guy... Oh, chat's... My internet. China internet sucks. <laughs> Anyways, uh, now it's at the 650s. And so this is the pattern that Tim talks about. The contract wins or... Um, contract win strategy it's not you know it's not the best uh in terms of like how much you can make but it is very predictable if you hit a bottom it, it tends to you have a chance of it you know spiking up and that's that's pretty much what it is you know shoulda coulda woulda sold right now it's now at 670s and it's squeezing up higher 680s uh, 668 six, oh, there you go now it's going even higher but you know i had the right idea going into this and i'm sure tim is probably you know, happy to, to see this, but I don't know if he's traded it or if he's watching this, but um, I figure I'd make another video lesson thing because I think it's just something nice to see. So that's pretty much it.